Wondering what the spring real estate market's gonna look like? We'll cover that today on Frequent Ask Friday. What is going on party people? My name is Chris Elliott with the Elliott Real Estate Team. In this video, we're gonna cover my personal predictions or what experts are predicting, forget my personal predictions, uh, for the spring 2022 real estate market, including Metro Richmond. If you would, before we jump into the content, like, subscribe, do all that fun stuff. I appreciate it. Thanks for tuning in. All right, so I got four, four items for you. Interest rates will continue to rise, but at a more moderate pace. So experts are predicting that we saw, we saw a sharp rise in uh, mortgage interest rates uh, over the last 45 days or so. They expect that they're gonna continue to increase but at a much more moderate pace. Number two, inventory will continue to be a challenge. So if you look at the buyer traffic index, you'll see the buyer traffic is super strong. Now granted, this is uh, from the National Association of Realtors. This is for the month of February, which is the numbers that NAR has at the moment. I would make the argument, uh, it hasn't really changed much. If, if anything else, we've seen buyer demand continue to increase. And then if you will look at the seller uh, traffic, basically the amount of listings that are coming to the market, it is super, super weak. So we're continuing to see very high uh, demand from buyers, very low supply from sellers. And then uh, if we look at the, the Metro Richmond month supply of inventory, we will see that the month supply of inventory jumped slightly from 0.5 month supply of inventory in the month of uh, February to 0.6 in the, in the month of March. Uh, but certainly still very much a seller's market. So number three, competition is going to be fierce. So as you will see in the graphic, uh, currently in the month of March, we saw that it took, or we were seeing 20 showings on average per listing in Metro Richmond. So basically uh, when a listing hit the market, there were 20 private showings. And keep in mind, this doesn't include any traffic uh, of people that came out to open houses, which is just a stat that's a lot harder to keep. So we're seeing a lot of demand around every single listing. And then last but not least, home prices will continue to climb. Uh, we've got seven different forecasters here. They're kind of you know all over the place, but the average of all the seven major forecasters is saying that we're gonna see a 6.7 appreciation rate in the year of 2022. So home prices are going to continue to rise. Good news if you're a seller or a homeowner, maybe not so good news if you're somebody that's looking to buy. So hope you found this useful. If you have any questions, concerns, thoughts, fears, if you have a good knock-knock joke, throw it in the comments below. Thank you guys for tuning in. Look forward to seeing you next week.